Hey, this is Mike with Christian Meds. This week I'm going to talk a little bit about meditation. Um, so let's get started. So, when I first started this channel, it's really, you know, I kind of had a, you know, an epiphany about, you know, all the different ways that God interacts with us. And one of the ways is when we're in the right state of mind, you know, to put Him first and foremost, then that ends up, um, you know, allowing us to hear from Him, allowing Him to act powerfully within our lives. And one of the things I've always thought was that if you are in the right frame of mind, that you can really um, get into a rest and relaxed state through meditation uh, and not, you know, the go, go, go or the, you know, fight and flight type state that so much of society is bound to at this point. The point where people are just completely stressed out with their lives and completely you know, not thinking about God, thinking more about just trying to make ends meet, trying to, you know, get the kids to the next sport event, or, you know, whatever else it is, you know, the next day at work, or, you know, getting the next project done, and we all have, you know, things that we have to produce, and things that we have to, work that we have to do to just make ends meet, but that's just one aspect of life. There's so much more when it comes to the spiritual side. And when you're in the, a nice rest and relaxed state, then you can really, you know, hear from God. You can really hear what He has for your life. Sometimes it's just um, a gentle nudge, you know. They call it about it being that oh quiet voice, you know. And sometimes you're like, was that you, Lord? You know, I mean. I know for myself, if I'm pushing, I don't have time to hear from the Lord sometimes. And that's really a problem for, for me and I think for a lot of people nowadays. You know, that we our lives are, you know, so busy and so we can fill every moment of the day with our cell phones or whatever else we're looking at. And um, we need to take time out. We need to put ourselves in a timeout, you know, and a lot of times it's just, you know, being mindful and taking the time to say, <sighs> and just take a deep, long, slow breath and just say, Lord, <sighs> I'm here to listen to you. And that shift right there, you know, I think is so important in our lives. And I think so much of our time, we don't take the five, ten minutes it would just take just to take some point of our day and make it to where God is the only thing we care about focusing on. We're not focusing on our job, we're not focusing on our kids, we're not focusing even on, you know, doing our laundry or whatever else. We're focusing on just taking a moment doing a timeout just for ourselves and saying, Lord, I'm here to think about you. I'm here to be with you. I'm here to just care about, you know, listening to you and being one with you and just being at peace with you and just think about just all the wonderful things the Lord has done in your lives. If you start thinking about the blessings and you have that as a mindset, an attitude of gratitude, of blessing in your life. That's how things shift. That's how things become just, um, just manifest in such a, just a, an amazing way. When when the Lord takes, when you take the time for the Lord, the Lord will bless you. And I'm just hoping that, you know. This is a message somebody needs to hear today, and I just hope that they find my channel and they have 
end up, you know, just getting the blessing that they need just by taking a deep breath and being one with the Lord, even for a moment. So that's my message this, this week. Hope to talk to you next week, and have a blessed week.